and one engine of a Boeing 737 explodes at 32,000 feet. Shrapnel from the blown engine smashes a window and damages the airplane's body. Then a desperate scramble on board to save a woman from getting sucked out. How would you deal with this mid-air emergency? Well, listen to a calm and steely-nerved Tammy Jo Schultz at the hem of Southwest Airlines flight saved over 140 lives. Yeah, we have a part of the aircraft missing, so we're going to need to slow down a bit. Okay, could you have the uh, medical meet us there on the runway as well? We've got uh, injured passengers. Injured passengers, okay. And are you, is your airplane physically on fire? No, it's not on fire, but part of it's missing. They said there was a hole in, and uh, someone went out. Um, I'm sorry, you said there was a hole and somebody went out? Okay, could you have the... Uh, a steely nerved, calm and collected Tammy Jo Schultz at the helm of the Boeing while chaos reigned in the cabin. Among the US Navy's first female fighter pilots, according to friends, Schultz was also the first woman to fly an FA-18 Hornet, a military training saving 147 people on board. Now for 13 80, right here when you're able, you want to stop wherever you need to. Thank you. We're going to stop right here by the uh, fire truck. Thanks, guys, for the help. Of course, the pilot, she was amazing. I mean, 30 years experience and just knew to get us down. And within five minutes or whatnot, 30,000 feet, that's pretty incredible. She's phenomenal. She's amazing. Angels sent by God and military training saved us. Another passenger thanking his star said, Clearly, while pushing the boundaries to be a U.S. Navy fighter pilot and trainer and a civilian pilot hero, Tammy Jo Schultz showing what she could do when the sky set the limits. Bureau Report, Beyond.